Ahoy, shipmates, Facebookers, YouTubers, and others. Billy Bones over there, his new duck friend over there, his girlfriend's over there. Jenny's on the front porch swing, talking to her sister, her single remaining sister out of four, uh, Anne, Frederick Anne. And I am here doing an introduction to what we um, did this morning. The rescue squad was called out, Jack and Jenny, rescue squad, so we went up and got somebody unstuck. <clears throat> now, I want to tell you something about being stuck. Uh, I say it a lot in the, in the video, but you know, on a farm, you're used to tractors being stuck and trailers being stuck and trucks being stuck, so you just go get them unstuck and don't worry about them. Um, that's just part of the way it is. Okay, so we were called up to get uh, an un, did an unstuck job. Now, the first part of the film I'm filming, and Jenny is the unsticker. The second part of the film, there, you can't tell there's two parts, but there is. The second part, Jenny's doing the film, and Ron is the unsticker. And from the time Jenny started filming until the unstuck was unstuck was about two seconds. And you don't get to see hardly anything. So, the first part of the film is pretty good uh, cameraman Jack did that so enjoy it hope you have a great day hope you have a wonderful day today um, Billy Bones over there is duck friend girlfriend Jenny's on the porch and everybody else saying thank you so much for watching and adios Captain Jack and Jenny's record service have been called out this morning you know here at the farm a lot of times because of the weather you'll have a pickup stuck or a tractor stuck so you just go get a, another tractor or a, <clears throat> another truck and pull it out. <clears throat> We've been called out early on this Sunday morning uh, to get someone unstuck. Oh, there's my red trailer. I think we have six trailers. And we're walking up here to the scene of where this sticking got. There's Jenny. Jenny will be doing the extraction today. Uh, she is a professional and uh, will not have any problem. Okay, so what we've got here is a goat stuck. Uh, she tried to get through the fence to eat the grass on this side. And so now she is stuck. Just a second, Jenny. Just, just a second, Jenny. And there she is, looking all nice and innocent. But she's stuck. So, Jenny's going to go over there and rescue the goat. This is called unsticking a goat. Hopefully, Hopefully unsticking a goat without having to tear up a fence. And of course, being a goat, she's not... Upset, got to turn her horns, got to twist her head. <laughs> okay, goat. Okay, back up. I might have to get in there. Yeah, I have to go inside the pen and pull her out the other way. Just part of the normal doings. Okay. So plan two. Come on back up, girl. Maybe I have to get in there and help. Yeah. Well, let me go. They walk around and get because I can't get in there. Oh, I was going to walk around. Okay, I was going to pull her backwards, but you. Okay. So Jenny's got to go through this gate through the loading chute. Uh, get around. She's peaceably standing there. Neil, oh, you nearly got yourself out, girl. 
Come on, fat girl. Stand up. <laughs> Well, it may take Ron. I'm gonna have to wait till to do what? To do what? To get Ron out here. To can I help? I don't think so. I can lift her up if no, you can push. No, no, you can't. No, we we'll just have to wait, Ron. Do a second show and get Ron, cause she almost did it. Yeah. Okay. Goats are a lot stronger than they look. Well, they're very strong. That's what. Come on, back. put your head back. Put your head back. Come on, girl. Okay, well, she'll be here until Ron and Terry get back from church, and then they'll come get her out. Okay, just stay there then. Dumb goat. Actually, go goats are extremely smart. She just about got herself out right then. But, of course, we don't cut these high-dollar fences just because the goat's got her head stuck in it. Okay, part two later. Okay, we're sending in the top gun, top goat getter outer of Troubler. And obviously it worked. Ma'am? Goodbye.